Hello everyone, I hope you're well. Can you get this? Look at this headline here. UK government calls for an extra 2.6 billion for asylum seeker hotels. Right, first off, 2.6 billion, but then the words asylum seeker. Let's get one thing straight. Let's call a spade a spade. They are not asylum seekers. France, as you well know, is a safe country. So they're not exactly fleeing war. What they are, are illegal, undocumented, young, economic migrant males. That's what they are. You know it. I know it. But it gets even worse here. Look at this. The UK government has asked for an extra 2.6 billion in funding after spending on hotels for asylum seekers. Scrap it. Scrap that word. Well, it was higher than expected. Home Secretary James Cleverly, <laughs> he's not very clever, has made the formal request for the cash after a shortfall last year when his predecessor, Suella Braveman, or wave the men in, held the post. In a statement to the House of Commons, Mr. Not So Clever said that the net cash requirement for the year exceeds that provided for this financial year. Parliamentary approval for additional resources of 2.6 billion will be sought in a supplementary estimate for the Home Office, he said. Now, when you think about it, last year, there were a couple of people that actually froze to death. They froze to death within walking distance of these asylum seeker hotels. It's a disgrace. It's a national disgrace. And I really, it really makes my teeth itch. Anyway, let me know what you think about this in the comments, guys. And I'll see you tomorrow for a live walkabout down here in Folkestone. All right. Thanks for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye for now.